Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Abhilash and I'm a trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the charts of US oil, NAS 100, US 30 and JAR 30. So, let's get started. So, first of all, let's talk about US oil. As we all know, oil market is extremely bullish because of the war between Russia and Ukraine. So, keep in mind, this is a news-driven market, news-sensitive market. So, as long as the war will continue, you should be looking for buy positions only. Today we have a dialogue between Russia and Ukraine. If there is a solution, if they come to a solution, then we may see some selling or correction on the chart of US oil. But keep in mind, as long as there is no solution to the war, war continues, oil will be bullish. Do not think that how far it will go, it, will, it should become a no. This is a news driven market. You must understand it very well. So on Monday, Okay, keep in touch with the news. Yes, <laughs> first of all, you must uh, stay in the touch with the news. Uh, you should know whether um, what is the present situation, what is the present uh, status of the war. Okay, if the tension continues, look for buy positions only. After the market opening, see how the oil market is doing. If you see oil market is breaking, oil market is breaking the last high and going up you can go for a buy above 117 level if it breaks the level of 117 and if the work still has no solution go for a buy above 117 but on monday if you see that after the market opening there is a correction on the chart of oil immediately look for a news yeah. <laughs> okay look for a news if you see that news is saying that um tension is coming down or something of that sort okay then that's a different chapter. Otherwise, if you see that there is no news about solution, then try to buy at 104 level. There is a possibility that market will be coming down and take support at 104 level. Okay. So if market takes support at 104 and bounces, go for a buy. If market breaks 117 level, then also go for a buy. If you have been trading for a considerable period of time, if you know how to do scalping and all, then you can look for selling position. But if you're a new trader, beginner, new to the market, then you should be following the only rule of the market that is follow the trend. And most importantly, this is a news driven market. Please stay in touch with the news. Okay. And those who trade on Brent, okay, XBR USD. Uh, it's uh, see this is the last traded price 116.71 for you also the strategy is the same okay the strategy is same once market crosses the level of 118.50 level okay observe the market if you see that the bullishness continues there is no solution to the war you can go for a buy above 118.50 level but if you see market is going for some correction and trying to bounce from 108 level you can take a buy as well observe the market watch the market around 108 level if you see market bouncing go for a buy clear now let's look at a chart of jar 30 heavy heavy sell off on jar 30 on monday if jar 30 tries to recover because of some news you can go for a buy but if you see that there is no news no hope no no um, news regarding peace then do not buy do not buy if you see the market is trying to recover on monday but there is no support of the news skip the market okay but if market breaks the level okay if you if market breaks the level of 12990 or if you see that market breaking the support last support and going down you can take a sell position but if market tries to recover without any fundamental factor do not buy clear if market goes down breaks the support not support the last low price 12990 you can take a sell position below this level as well now let's look at nas 100 nas 100 chart is for nas 100 i would like to take it a four hours chart again on monday observe the market carefully and see most importantly keep in touch with the news <laughs> okay so after the market opening if you find market going up observe the market around 14200 level or 14400 level around this level why this level because we have a trend line let me show you you can see that the trend line has been acting as a dynamic resistance for a for a long time and we also have 200 period moving average so both these factors make 
this is a very very strong resistance zone 14200 to 14400 level and if there is no fundamental factor if there is no news to support the buying in the market you can expect a sell around 14200 to 14400 if market reverses we can definitely take a sell position around this level but if market breaks or if after the market opening if you see market going down going or crossing 13600 level okay you can also take a sell as well okay so market opening will be very very crucial if the selling pressure continues in the market you can take a sell below 13600 but if market tries to recover and market go up you can take a sell around this level okay market opening will be very very crucial and if you take a sell below 13600 your target will be this 13000 so there is a huge gap here so mark the market opening and the any news on the weekend will be extremely important for the market and for the market reactions okay. last chart us 30 33,560 last traded price if market goes up good possibility of market facing selling pressure around 34,000 level or 34,050 level if there is no news then we can expect a good selling pressure around this level if market reverses from 13, 34,000 level take a sell position but if we see the selling pressure is there in the market, if market breaks the level of 33,100, 33, okay, then we can take a sell position below this level. So again, market opening will be very, very important. If heavy selling comes, market will break 33,100 and we can take a sell. But if we use, if you want to take a buy, if you see market taking support around this level, the present level, you, you are free to take a buy position as well. But if market goes up, we can expect a sell around this level. So weekend news, weekend developments uh, over the uh, Russia Ukraine war will be very very important. Keep in touch with the news and please use proper risk management and stop loss. And uh, because this is a news driven market, very volatile market. Please protect your capital, protect your hard earned money. Bye bye, take care.